Hello and welcome back to Pick and Place Husband 4 with the Führerreich mod. We are back in the Deutsche Reich. Now then, down here in the south in the Sinai, the British have decided to come back in force, being pushed back all the way from the Suez Canal. Now then, how are we going to hold on to this? Because we run into a serious problem where we don't have a lot of shipments that can come in through here. Looks like a lot of our shipments just get destroyed as they try. And it's kind of a narrow causeway to try and get troops in. We're going to take out the Hellenic Republic, as that's the last bastion on the continent for the Entente, while we try to think of ways to take out Great Britain. Now that we got naval combat up here, but we're just going to leave it. Just going to leave it alone. We're fine. Took out a couple. Uh -huh, and uh -huh. Good. Now, if they have all these troops down here, they probably don't have a whole lot of troops up in the north. Mount an SSR. Decline. Hmm. Would it be worth it to try and hold the whole line? Probably not. Let's just hold this little causeway right in front of the former Jewish Commonwealth. You, I am going to want you to take up a position here, attacking Athens itself, while we get closer. Because that would be quite the holdout. As for the rest of us, we're holding up pretty well. You, we're trying to get an army down here, a new army. However, I'm afraid that if we try to keep it all together at once, they won't move. They'll probably take a boat or something. Take it like that. Yeah, okay, good. They at least are staying on land. So yeah, we're kind of pulling back from the Sinai, letting them trickle out. Although, if we could do a daring charge through their lines while doing an attack like that, I definitely would not mind it. Mm-hmm. Let me attack, please. If I can get those troops cut off, it'd be a great day. Ah, okay, new flak gun. We can get that into production. And 1941 now. Improved artillery. 1941 is not a day for this, but we do have new ones. 1941 is, though, the Zeek. The Panzer of Falaker Zeek. Or the newest heavy tank. Might as well. Let's get some heavy tanks. Yes, attack through. We can attack. Nope, nope, nope. Up and through. Meanwhile, you can do the same. Because these are light tanks. They're fairly small divisions. And they're actually fairly small infantry divisions as well. They're not exactly the best for this job. However. Ooh. Follow up, follow up. Okay. If that's not good enough, keep going. If we, if at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Okay, that's not going to work either. And now they have ten divisions there. Hmm. Uh-huh. What if I delete your orders? Give you a new line. And then... You. Light green. Light green boy. Give you a new line there. Try and keep it up. Keep it up. Or not. Just hold off for now. Hold back, hold back. We can at least try. Hmm. The fact that they have so many troops right there is interesting to me. As well as some new marine divisions, sea lander divisions. Okay, we'll put them in here. Nope. We'll make a division for them. Put them in there. <clears throat> They're going to need a commander. How about Albert Kessling, brilliant Spanish war hero and cautious, although he is wearing Luftwaffe attire, so it's kind of irony there. Maybe from Normandy, attack onto, I don't know, Portsmouth with these five. I need to start doing naval invasion tech, huh? What about we attack there to make them stop for a second? Then with you, I would like to move that way, please. They're trying to run. Don't let them. Don't let them run. Try to make a pocket the best we can. Attack on through. Attack on through. Keep it pushing, keep it pushing. We might just be attacked from behind, but you know, we can do this. Uh, try to attack through to Cairo, because they have all their troops stuck behind now. Attack on through, attack on through, attack on through. Just do our best to try and hold these guys into position. You attack there for now. It's not going to be enough because they do have this one area, but at least 
You attack back to the Suez Canal and close it off again. New, yes, that's right. Okay, you need your new gun. Then what? Our attack through this area is definitely a dogged one. They certainly have a lot of troops here. At least we have this, and you guys get on Greece, please. Over Greece. Uh, mm, no. My airborne troops aren't ready yet. You at least support in that attack. I'm gonna try our best. Attack. Attack, attack, attack. Yeah, they're gonna send a lot of their troops, but that might leave a weak center. Yes, it left a weak center. Attack on through. They might just be trying to run away now. Send the troops in, send the troops in. No, in. We can use this to our advantage at the moment. Oh, these troops are gonna get cut off. Boy. And with that, these troops should be able to fall. Nice, nice. Over here, still nothing big. Oh, you are still... Oh, the Hindenburg. That's a nice name for a battleship. Although now we should be producing that new battleship, that new crazy sensation, two in a year for the Kriegsmarine, and the new one a year in the auto... No, go to Kriegsmarine. The new battleship, the battleship three, the Führer class. Nice. Gerderi. Gerderian's plan. Panzer programs, armor technology, still useful. And then recruitment. Tons of divisions. Uh, do we have... No, it's 100 days until we get the Sonderkraft Führerzug. And 50 days until we get the Panzerkampf 4. Ah, nice. We cleaned up. See, that's why you just... Gotta notice these things a little bit. Okay, we can at least come through here, take Alexandria. Then you, Manstein, the new Desert Fox. You'll be taking a daring mission across the desert. If you don't mind. Go, go, go. Meanwhile, you hold behind and do something a little bit like that. Up to Cairo. Mm-hmm, good. How far do we want to push this? Going down through here does not really interest me. The capitals of Kingdom of Italy and Kingdom of France are right here, as well as the Suez Canal. I want to push through North Africa. Go away, Dagestani SSR. Or SR. Ooh, is that... We formed another pocket without even trying. My sons, you know me so well. Okay, in that case, you, with your 40 stack divisions, will focus entirely on the closing of this pocket. Go, go. Attack from all directions. Keep no prisoners. I suppose it's take no prisoners. You... New line, right there. Push down to here. And I don't want to take a guess onto how many troops are in Athens. So we want to get at least close enough for the invasion to really kick off. Then we should be fine there, up here. We have pushed well past the Suez, now into Cairo. Killed a lot of their units in the process. Now they're kind of just dealing with whatever troops they can bring up. Modify the government again, we can go for Messerschmitt, Fighter, Junkers, Volkswolf. Yeah, that seems pretty good, especially in the war against Britain. Where, let's take a look, take a gander. At the very least, we're starting to bring as many as they can. 500 less, but still, we got some good ones. They got Esprit, Inner War. They're using a lot of Inner War fighters. We're using Messerschmitts and Volkswolfs. Then down here, we have. Oh, we lost our entire fleet. Or at least the majority. Yeah, you. Get off that, get back on, and go away. You're done, you're done, son. Construction, production. We don't have any more production of these, so we'll get some submarines out. Give them a full stack. Give them 10 more, send them to, you will what, Vagden? You will, yeah, you will Vagden. We can give it over, that's all right. Give them to Vegden, as they're having problems. They're the more risky. And as for us, ooh, looks like they're starting to actually push back. 
If we can cut them off there, we at least cut them into two pieces. Looks like we're not able to fit all of our troops there at once. That pocket up there has been taken care of. And now we can start using my good troops on the march towards Athens. If we take Thessaloniki, it'll just be a matter of taking Athens, and I suppose Rhodes, or Crete. Heraklion. It's basically all inside of Athens is where they have their victory points. And then it'll just, hmm, be a process of rolling up, I suppose. These troops here, they're spreading out a bit too much. Just focus up here in the north. Push to there, to El Alamein. Please do so. You up in here. You're not doing your move? Go for it. Do it. I dare you. As for this, I don't think Romania should have this much land. As for control of states, Burgos, Boldiv, Ebiden, Jopia. Hmm, what would be fair for them to take? Maybe Viden. Smolin, Eastern Thrace, and Thrace. Okay, that's too much. Hmm, they would at least let me take that much. So let's give them Burgos and Boldiv while we take the south. Good, so now, now we can stop them from taking our stuff. The Salonike has been surrounded down here. Our attacks aren't doing the greatest. But hey, buddy boy, what's this? Is that a free shot to Alexandria, I see? You attack there. Ah, dang. You attack that way. Cut them off in multiple directions, good. And then, the Salonika is still fighting on, but not for long. Ooh, we can see what's actually here. There's some Serbian troops, five divisions of Royal Infantry Divisions, and then a division there. Probably too strong for my paratroopers just yet. But with time, we'll be able to do it. One of the big issues is the fact that we don't have the initiative as we, as the Germans did in World War II, just because Without also, why is this on? Take that off. It's a bit distracting. We don't have the same initiative that the Germans did because they had the Italian Navy, which helped them control the Mediterranean for taking out things like Greece. We do not have that same control. All of our control is up here in this navy. Although, except for the Hindenburg, we have some very good ships: Bismarck, Geisenau, Hindenburg, the von von der Tran. And you need to restock. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, good, good. Right there, right through El Alamein. Hit him right where it hurts. El Alamein. And then continue with your plan. Yeah, and then after that, I would like you to start taking out Benghazi area. Start moving through. You're fast. Your troops are fast. They can do it. And what kind of troops are following? Because how about you with your troops split in half? Yeah, whatever troops are joining with this force. Half your troops become a new army. Give them a new general. Mm, Panza, Panza, Panzas. Why are they all Panzas? Yeah, this guy. Give him that line. Have him start moving out. While you, Turkey, this is basically a new theater. North Africa. So rather, uh, not that important of a theater. European theater can probably take a bit of a dive too. Turkey can have a bonus. But you can be here and you can have his force. Although you're getting bonuses from that general, so it's okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Though for now you can come down. Are there any of my generals I can boost up to being a field marshal? Hazan Van Mattel, he is a career officer, so let's promote him. Then, with you guys, give me that new field marshal. 
And offensive doctrine, please. Organization first. Sure. And you can take charismatic. No, no, you cannot. I do not have the points for this. Yes, they can have both of those forces and they can push out. Turkey, you're fine. Hey. It says Deutsche Reich is a controller, and yet I do not. I do not seem to control it. Oh, yeah, we're going to have problems with the resist. Ooh, really? They're resisting, even while we have these troops on top of them. Wow. And dang, son, what happened to your army, Mr. Deutschstaat? Deutschstaat. Do I need to give you back your troops? I might need to give you back your troops. We've been sending them all across the world to fight for us. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Just go around them, please. Take me to the moon. No. Getting the flanking shot is so much less important than surrounding them entirely. Ooh, look at that. Spearpunkt. Hey, they got Swiss troops. Well, you know what happened when we started seeing Belgian troops? We just killed them. Just killed them all. Also, what's this? Your troops on this line to the south. Start pushing down to, at the very least, this border. Slowly, if you don't mind. And then you, with your troops, you're basically doing garrison detail for the Ottomans. You can have that. Nothing's really going on in Yerevan. These troops are almost entirely just Greek now. New tank. Thank you. I can get back up here. Medium tank ones, we have a surplus, so we can go on to the Panzer fours. Systems available. What is it? War propaganda against Dagestani? Why? Do you have plans to attack me yet? Anti submarines? Air support? Nah, no, you don't. Uh, oh, I could have. No, I haven't taken any points on that. Good. Before we do any. Of... No, it's so cheap. Jagdpanzer. Panther. So cheap, we can just do it. Tungsten's a bit of a problem. So let's get more from France, as France is basically our provider of everything that we could ever need. Good old France. Meanwhile, you guys, just do it. You keep going. Hold them in place, and we'll do the same trick, if you don't mind. Hold the Swiss troops in place, and push through. Yeah, they stand no chance. What does Britain have in reserve? Dealing with the opposition, they got a million manpower. They really have a 93 to 113 divisions. I have 222. You have possibly the same amount, but on fewer fronts. Republic of Turkey, the greatest. Yeah, uh -huh, good. Keep your troops charging, my boy. Keep your troops charging. Then, I suppose we could just pull out with these. Give me your Volksgrenadiers and your Jebus Jägers. Send them over the seep while you can just pull off for now. You can set up the defensive border on this side. And why didn't that go all the way across? Because we don't need to flood those anymore. Also, this army would definitely be the one to take a lot of the... Mountaineers with them, if we took them. Panzer programs, good. Tiger Fevel, Blitzkrieg. Sounds good to me. Military factories. Hmm. Looks like we do have quite the problem. Military factories, what do I really need? You seem to be fine. More than fine. You could use some. You could probably use some. And then we got plenty of toad artillery. You there in the North Africa? Hey, didn't I give you specifically a field marshal to help you with these problems? Yes, good. Go around them wherever possible. Good. I like your moxie. Pushing in to Libya. And they don't get to come back, right? Rhineland, Hellenic Republic, Second... Kingdom of France, they technically exist inside of Algiers, so we need to kill both Italy and France back in their African holdings. 
this or propaganda against the dead Stanny. No. Just completely closed propaganda efforts. What was that? North Africa is have very low supply. Very low supply in Turkey as well. To be expected, really. Uh-huh. A lot of problems with a lot of problems with those islands. Though we do have the Kingdom of Sweden helping out. And you with your forces, you still have your plan. Aggressive, my friend. Oh, I need to tell you to go. That's why. And, ooh, what's this? Greece is just naval invaded. Mm. North Atlantic is a fight, but it's not really that much of a fight. You have five. Atomic research is done. That's 1943. So we have time for some decryption and encryption. Not all the good stuff. Republic of Turkey, looking fine. Getting back their old gains. Now, if I could verify the fact that there would be, like, some way to get my troops off, I could do attacks onto these areas. But I do see that we now have the Jagdpanzer. The Jagdpanzer 4. Tank storage. Tanks with larger than normal guns. Do it, do it. Meanwhile, these get 50% off. Time to research four days! Hot damn, boy! That's a Siegfried. Four days. It's too good not to take four days of a tank research that's two years ahead of time. That is breaking the game if I've ever seen one. But with that, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye!